Hey guys, it's Couponing with Jen back with another video. Um, and I just want to let you guys know I've been working on this video since Sunday. Um, but I've, um, I recorded it a couple of times and then, uh, I wanted to add something. And so, anyway, um, I'm finally going to go through with this and put everything that I need to put in the video. That way I don't have to redo this. Um, because it's already Wednesday and this is Saturday's haul. But anywho, um, this is my Dollar General haul from Saturday where they had the $5 off a $25 deal. Um, I've heard and seen a lot of people saying that their store was basically a complete fail when it came to the coupons. And this one is pretty much no different. Um, <coughs> excuse me. So I just want to go over everything that I got and what the price should have been. Or what coupon should have been used um, and I'm gonna go through this pretty quick so um, just to let you guys know these are a dollar we had the 50 cent off coupon uh, making those 50 cents these are a dollar as well we had a dollar off coupon now there is a 50 cent coupon as well there's a manufacturer and printable dollar off coupon uh, the glade back there they're the same thing the oil <clears throat> oil warmers but they are two different packages I don't know why but those are a dollar we had a dollar off coupon everyone knows about the Swiffer deal from PNG 3-4 it's the buy one the buy the starter kit get the refill for free so the starter kit is four fifty. the refill is eight dollars uh, then this kiss nail art um, there is a dollar off printable these are a dollar uh, so these were free and they're really cute too. Um, the Clorox 2 and all deal. This was $2.50. Um, this was $1.50. We had $3 off both, making those 50 cents each. Then this was a dollar. Um, I've heard, and I don't remember which video that was, but I will um, post the name if I figure it out. Um, I heard this was a really good product and I wanted to try it because it's almost um, time for us to move out of this apartment. So I just want to make sure that everything's, you know, clean as can be. So I bought that just to try it out. It was only a dollar. When I got to the register, I was, I, I don't know why, but I thought this package was five dollars total. Um, and it wasn't. It was four dollars total. So I had to get this, which I wasn't mad about um, because I'm just going to use it for, uh, again, one of the Easter uh, baskets that I'm making. <clears throat> so let's go to my receipt well let me tell you about the first sign that I had that I should have known that it was going to be trouble I handed her the $5 off 25 first obviously that's the one we're supposed to hand first because if we use any other coupons it won't be $25 anymore so I handed her the $5 off 25 and this I'm just going to call her a lady. This lady um, was like, you can't use this. I said, well, why not? She said it expires on the 24th. I said, what's today? She said the 24th. I said, exactly. It, it expires at the close of business. And so she asked her manager. Her manager was like, yeah, you can use that. So she went ahead and, and scanned it. Then, um, she started scanning my other coupons. Uh, for instance, this would have been free. Um, she then told me that they do not give out free items. So, I said, you're not giving me a free item because you're getting reimbursed for it. I'm giving you these coupons, which in, is just like money if you follow the instructions on sending it off. And you're giving me the product. So she talks to her manager. Her manager's like, yeah, we don't give out free items. Uh, they told us not to. I said, is that a new coupon policy? She said, uh, I do not know. I said, okay, do you have it? She said, no, ma'am, I don't. I said, okay, well, good thing that I do because I can show you it's not in there. So the manager was like, well, I'll go ahead and do it for you this time. I said, no, you're not doing it for me. You're doing it because it's your job. And I said, I'm going to need your number to corporate. She said, ma'am, I just said that I'll do it for you. I said, okay. And again, I'm going to need your number to corporate. So I guess she got mad because I wanted the number to corporate. She ended up not pushing my coupons through. And 
and I was already holding up the line. Um, I let people go ahead of me, so I didn't hold up the line, but I was there fussing with them um, so long that I, there were still people lined up behind me. So I went ahead and just, whatever coupon she didn't take, I went ahead and took them back. And here is my receipt. Um, we have the palm olive, the carefree. You see, there's nothing taken off of the carefree. Except for the store discount, the Kiss, the All Swiffer, um, Awesome Cleaner, Starburst, and then you look down here. Not a completely bad deal. Um, five twenty-five is what I spent. Uh, five sixty-eight with tax. Had I been able to use these four coupons over here, I would have paid less than two dollars. So, what I did was I called corporate. And corporate said that they should have accepted my coupon and any amount that was remaining from the coupon. Like, let's say if this would have been 50 cents and I had the dollar off, then the 50 cents should have applied to the rest of the items. This is directly from corporate. So, um, they did say that they're going to have the district manager call me. And she said in most cases, they will either give me a gift card for the amount that, um, that the coupon should have been or the, she'll, he'll let me go in with my coupons and give me that money back. So either way, um, it looks like something's going to be, you know, something's going to happen. Um, I know I remember reading Greg, that dude said that he had a problem with Dollar General not responding to him, I think via Facebook. Um, I don't know if you've tried, Greg, I don't know if you've tried calling them but the lady I spoke to her name was Jessica and I'm not sure if it's like a call center or if it's just an office but Jessica she was very helpful um, and uh, she you know she said that someone should call me today or tomorrow so at this point I'm just waiting for the call and uh, yeah this is my haul again it's not too bad because it was five dollars but it would have been better if it was under the two dollars like I planned and um yeah, this is my Dollar General haul. Um, there was a couple of other things that I got last week that I didn't post in the video. Um, the Kotex pads at my store, um, there was some on clearance for 80 cents. We had the dollar off printable, got those for free. Um, again, some of you are aware of those uh, little Easter bunnies. Those, um, I got about five or six of them for about, uh, they range from 30 to 60 cents each. Um, they're pretty cute little bunnies that I'm putting in the Easter baskets. Um, what else did I get? More Revlon from Target. Um, and that's really it. Yeah, that's really it. So, again, this is my Dollar General haul. Hopefully I get a call back about... Uh, the situation in the store and thanks for watching and happy couponing